Welcome back to LWC Super Channel, ladies and gentlemen. Time to head straight into fight number one this evening. Please put your hands together for Brian Mura. Mong Kon Chai, Ma Puana, Nai Pon Kon Kon A lot of four-man tournaments over the years. What my four-man tournaments that is. And you never know. Yeah. You gotta wonder though, with his, with his experience, if he's just looking for that opening, waiting for that moment, but... I don't think there's any disputes. So but again, he's spending a lot of time in the back foot. Doesn't look good. Don't think it's going to be working to his benefit. Good barrage of punches there by Brian Mora. Otherwise, Brian's going to coast probably to a victory and then go on to the finals. If he did this earlier, I mean, he would have had a much better chance. Again, with a kick landing. Good combination from Brian Mora. Very nice one landing from Mong Kong Chai. And Mong Kong Chai's corner seems quite confident. But he's won the match. And the winner heading through to the four-man tournament final this evening is from the blue corner, Brian Mura, Jack Brazil. Fighting out of Rage Fight Academy, representing France. This is Bryce Urare. Nongro Soto Chayawan from Thailand! In Japan as well. And then here, back in the Lupi Boxing Stadium. Good punches here. Good kicks as well by Brees. Good solid. Big shovel hit there. Fires back on a high kick, Nongro. Good kick to the body there from Nongro. Again with the elbows. Determined inside that clinch. Especially with the straight knees and with the right hands there from Brees, putting her combinations together very well. Moret well, returns one of his own, Nongros returns, and once again, Nongros returns again with the knee straight to the midsection. But I think, really, it's the second bout. Good kick there for Nongros, but the low kicks really looking like they're having an effect on Nongros. Nongros is not going to be enough. And Brees, another right hand connecting, left hand connecting. Nong Rose in a world of trouble at the moment. In the second round, notice that Nong Rose completely abandoned the clinch, not being on the inside at all. And here we go, some more barrage of attacks from Brees Warren. Another one, two there, Brees going for the elbow. Especially touches on Nong Rose with that right hand and attempting to spin elbow. You can tell he's comfortable now because he's doing pretty much anything that he, that he wants at will. Good seat there by Nong Rose, and that is the end of the third and final round. Our winner, heading into the final, Nong Rose! Sotar Chayawan, representing New Zealand. Please give it up for Jenna Whiteman! Claire Rankine from Scotland! Already some attacks from Jenna, good low kick from Claire Rankine. The New Zealander. Right hand landing for Claire Rankine. A big elbow coming in. Two elbows in a row for Claire Rankine. Body shot from Claire. It seems like Jenna is in a lot of trouble right now. Yeah, backing up on the ropes. Takes another big body shot. And now we know it. The key to victory for Claire Rankine is the body shots. And she's trying to line that right hand up. See her setting it up. Going jab up top and then straight right to the body. Over and over. Yeah, why not? Just keep going for it. I mean, once you see your opponent react to a certain shot in a bad way, why not continue to attack it? And it's surprising that Whiteman being so adept in the clinch, she's not trying to close the distance. Great fight so far from the Livingston native. Forehead, I believe. Yeah, look. Oh, takes another one oh, across the nose. Oh, my goodness. Our cut here. What a match this is. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if this was voted the fight of the night. And we're only in round one, John. Without a doubt. What a war. Another elbow landing for Claire. Claire going to back to the body. Jenna returning with a knee of her own. Everybody is standing up with their phones out right now. Doing what they're trained to do. And Jenna, white man's cut needs to be checked. And ladies and gentlemen, in bout number three here this evening, a thrilling battle has ended in round number two with the result a draw some up. That is a draw. The referee deemed it unsafe for both athletes. This is Ali Reza Amir Zadi. This is Luke Barr. Charging. 
Now they take a couple of shots early on from the Iranian. Luke Barr still not firing back. Low kick. But so far, definitely looking like it's obvious on this round. Ooh. You gotta wonder how much does Amizada have left in the tanks. I mean, he's been non stop with his attacks. Yeah, oh, another solid right elbow that time from Luke Barr. Another elbow from the Welshman. Yeah, you can see he's just lining up that right elbow over and over. Luke now determined to continue to push forward. Oh. Big elbow landing for the Welshman. And he's straight down the middle and return by Amizade. Ruling round this one. Punches, elbows, knees. Deep to the face there from Luke Barr to end the third and final round. For our winner, Luke Barr takes the win. Please give it up for Chut Pet Longley and Gila Lampa from Thailand. Kun Suk Gien Chalun Chai from Thailand. It didn't take long, I mean, Chut Pet. I'd like to push forward. A little bit more than a traditional boy type with that technical ability. Let's be honest, I mean, a lot of people, anyone could be attending Bangkok City Thailand. Yeah, two of the best from the region is doing what they do here. Kunsuk is giving the chop head just way too much space to work and too much time to breathe. I mean, look at that, a kick just across the back. It's been no problem for chop head. Yeah. Good job done now, good combination there. Punches followed up by the kick now from Chuck Pet. Chuck Pet connected clean on his opponent. Again, the right hand landing at will. Yeah, you but gotta give him credit. Just being overwhelmed like that. And that is the end of the third and final round. A great showing. We have a winner, Chuck Pet. Long lead Kila Lampang. Which is that one knee. Fighting out of Roy in Thailand. This is Chok Chai Pran Yisipo Ponek Mo Puna Naipon Konkan from Thailand. Dangerous styles in Muay Thai, traditional Muay Thai at least. Collect is going to handle this clinch work. He's going to keep his opponent on the outside. Not just yet, no. But here we go, he tries to go to the inside, but he gets a knee before his trouble. And Put Egg trying to get his hands onto the inside. What a throw back oh, elbow right there. Looks like Chok Chai is hurt. Yeah, he buckled the legs. At the moment with Chok Chai. If he gets caught with another inside elbow, that's on it. Chok Chai really trying to hold on to the lock, but getting elbowed for his work. Yeah, he's you gotta give it to him. He's, he's a very brave, brave to fight it because he knows the elbows are coming, but. Yeah, he's really trying to get into a dominant position in there, but of course, pay the price for it with an elbow. And like I said earlier, as a boy coward, a good knee fighter, you gotta take some to give some. Round number five. I think he dreams about being the clinch as well. He clinches that side pillow, clinches in his dreams, he wakes up, starts thinking about clinching right away. Ooh, in the fifth round is if or either fighter feels they won the fight. And the uh, winner is Blue Corner! Ladies and gentlemen, our final fight this evening, the final of the Ngun Chayo four-man tournament, Brian Mura! Nongro Sato Chayo Wa! Good low kick from Nongro's landing. I've seen uh, Mora compete a couple of times. Oh, and that oh, was a nice flying knee there, but the <laughs> referee decides it not to count. Nongro's last four. Picture perfect. Solid right hand there from Brian. Good sweep there. Kick from Nongro's. And a good sweep again from the Brazilian. Kick to the midsection. And solid knee to the midsection by Brian. Going for the elbows. Yeah, got one Rose trapped in the corner there. And for the finish. Oh. And that is no doubt a... So answering the eight count. Could be on borrowed time though, Nung Rose. Back in for the finish here. Can he land those elbows again? Big right hand. That's got to be it. That's got to be it. No, nope. and that is it, ladies and gentlemen. It is a second round. A TKO victory for Brian Mora.